Expressions in math are mathematical statements that have a minimum of two terms containing numbers, variables, or both. It is connected by an operator in between. The mathematical operators can be of addition, subtraction, multiplication, or division. In this video, I will teach you how to write a mathematical expressions. You can use this in your upcoming civil service examination. Since mathematical expressions are very useful in word-related problems, such as age problem, work problem, motion problem, and etc. We have here a sample problem. Myrna, Daisy, and Christina got a few ribbons. Daisy has 10 more ribbons than Myrna. Christina says that she has four more ribbons than the number of ribbons that Myrna and Daisy together have. Can you express this in the form of an expression? Understand the wording. It says there that Daisy has 10 more ribbons than Myrna. So, in this case, we don't know yet Myrna's total number of ribbons. We let x for the total number of ribbons that Myrna has. Since Daisy has 10 more ribbons than Myrna, we add 10 to the x, which is Myrna's total number of ribbons. Also Christina said that she has four more ribbons than Myrna and Daisy together have. Meaning, Myrna and Daisy's total number of ribbons, plus four ribbons. But how can we write this in an expression? All you have to do is to add Myrna, Daisy, and Christina's total number of ribbons. So we have x plus x plus 10, then plus 4. Why we add 4 to Myrna and Daisy's total number of ribbons? Again, Christina said she has 4 more ribbons than Myrna and Daisy. And that's the reason why we add 4 to both Myrna and Daisy's total number of ribbons. x plus x is just 2x, then 10 plus 4 is equal to 14. Therefore, it's 2x plus 14. This is for Christina's total number of ribbons. Next example. Rosie loves to plant flowers in her square-shaped plots. She planted tulips and orchids in two different plots. The side of the square plot where tulips are planted is 4 feet greater than the side of the square plot where orchids are planted. Which plot area is bigger and by how much? Write this in the form of an expression. Now, we let y feet for the side of the orchid square plot. Then, y plus 4 feet for the side of the tulip square plot. We add 4, since it is mentioned in the statement that Tulips are planted 4 feet greater than. When we say greater than, it's addition. Since we are looking for the plot area, that is bigger than the other plot. Let's recall that the formula for an area of square is to square the length of its side. We only square one side length since square has four equal side lengths. So the area of the square plot with orchids is y squared. And the area of the square plot with tulips is equal to y plus 4 squared. It is already obvious that the area of the tulips plot is bigger than orchids plot. But the question is, by how much? For us to find how bigger is tulips plot, let's get the difference of the area of both plots. Let's subtract y plus 4 squared and y squared. Note that this is quadratic equation since it is raised to the power of 2. FOIL method can be used to solve for y plus 4 squared. y times y, it's y squared. y times 4, it's 4y. Four, 4 times y. It's also 4y. And lastly 4 times 4. It's 16. Combine like terms. So we have 
y squared plus 8y plus 16. Now, let's subtract y squared, which is the area of the orchid's plot. y squared minus y squared is 0, so we left with 8y plus 16. Therefore, the tulip's plot is 8y plus 16 feet, bigger than orchid's plot. You may try this one. Thank you.